In this video, I'm going to import some custom fonts that I have on my local machine that I have downloaded. But the way I defined the fonts is I went on to the Costa website. I have a Chrome extension called What Font, which you can download from the web store. If I click on the font, if I click on the icon there, I can just hover over the headings and I can see here that the main headings are brand and grotesque bold and also for the body tags so the p tags we have a font of gotham book i have pre-downloaded these fonts and got them on my local machine i will also make them available in the description but what i will do is on my package json level i'm going to create a new folder called public within this folder i'm going to import my font and also import my images so if i just drag them in to my public folder like so so now I have my fonts, I have the Brandon Grotesque and the Gotham Book Regular. And then I also have images which I will use for the rest of this project. Now what I need to do is to change the fonts. I am first off going to create again a new file in the package JSON level. So if I click new file and I'm going to name this global.css. And in here, I'm going to define two font faces. The first font face, I will just copy across and explain. So I have two font faces in here. So the source URL is where I'm going to pull my fonts from. So if I go into my public folder, so in the current directory, and I have found public like so, go into the font folder, and then as you can see gotham book is there so i'll select that name it the font family of gotham book i will define that one and then if i do the same thing for brandon grotesque and i don't have the bold font on here so if i select the regular like so give it the font family of brandon grotesque and now that i've defined my font faces and i now need to add them into my html elements so i have already predefined this so for the html and body i am going to have a zero padding and zero margin and all the body elements are going to have the font family of gotham book all my headings are going to have the font family of brandon grotesque what i also want to do with the brandon grotesque is because i don't have the bold font i will give it a font weight of bold so now all my headings should be in bold there is one more step which is on my app.js file i don't need the global style anymore so what i will do is i'll just delete that and the global style also and delete the import within my app.js file so now if i save everything and then i import my styles from my global css so up a directory and then if i find the global css and now i save my fonts should change and the margin and padding should also have changed as well so now we have successfully imported the images and also the custom fonts that are on our local machine if we wanted to do it via google fonts there are ways to do that so if we go on to font optimization you can essentially in import these link style tags within the head next head component so if you read through this document it would tell you how to implement via the head as opposed to if you didn't have the local fonts in place 